Hello and welcome back to AP Tech Tutorials. Uh, in this short video today, I will show you how you can uh, actually change uh, Outlook to the latest and greatest view, uh, which is this option here on the top. I'm just going to get to this in a second. But before I get into that, I just want to tell you that this is uh, uh, this machine is running a Windows 11 uh, Pro. Uh, this is the latest and greatest update uh, from Microsoft. Uh, and uh, this is probably the look that you're going to have in your PC. I want to show you before I get the change into the new look. I just want to show you something, uh, which is kind of change some of the changes in the new look. Uh, you see this menu here: Office account, feedback, options, etc. This menu is going to be moved inside, and uh, I'm just going to go ahead and uh, and try the new look. So I'm just when I'm going to click here, um, it's going to ask me: Are you sure you wanna you wanna you wanna change? Select the switch to. Uh, to preview the new outlook, blah, blah, blah. And then I go into switch. I'm just going to go switch. And because I've changed it before uh, and I revert it, uh, it's going so quickly. Uh, but in your case, uh, chances are that you will be asked a couple of questions before. They're very basic questions. Uh, reply yes to all of them and then go ahead. So uh, this is actually the new look uh, in Outlook. So as you can see, all this menu here, it's gone. And um, you can have uh, the view settings here, right? Now, you can do everything that you have in the previous menu that I show you uh, when you click on file, it's all been, uh, uh, it's all been moved to here to quick setup. So you when you click on quick setup, you have the account option. Remember we saw it in the left panel previously, we have the general tab, uh, we have the mail tab, uh, you know, to compose email, all the configurations, the rule, etc., etc. You have the calendar, how you want the calendar to be set up, etc., etc. So so let's say, for example, you want to create a rule and um, you just select this message from here. Let's say, for example, I just want to move everything that comes from Facebook. I'm just going to move it to a folder named Facebook and I'm just going to right click. Uh, I see you can see here you don't have I have a, a, a folder named Facebook, but I'm just going to delete it just for this presentation. Um, so let's say, for example, I'm okay, here I, I come here and I see this Facebook uh, um, email that came in. I'm just going to say. Uh, view, um, I'm sorry, I'm just going to select advanced actions, create rules. And when I create a rule, I'm, I'm just going to say always move messages from Facebook to this folder. And then I select, uh, I see Facebook here, but this is probably because this is cash up there. Don't worry about it. Um, I'm just going to say, I'm just going to create a new folder because I deleted Facebook here before. So I'm just going to call Facebook and I'm just going to say save. Okay, and that you see was created here on the left panel and here. Um, now, if I want to add more options to, to this one here, you click on more options, but uh, for now, I'm just going to let it be. Uh, just click OK. So uh, I'm just going to run the rule. So this email needs to go to Facebook. I click OK and it will go to the Facebook folder. So every email now that comes from Facebook is going to go directly into the Facebook uh, folder. Okay, so this is one of the rules uh, of e email. So uh, it's also there's also uh, other quick steps here um, and uh, you can manage all these uh, quick steps very easily. Uh, this is your account. If you want to add a signature to your account, if you want to categorize, the, you know, the emails, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera, uh, you can always uh, do it here. And also in the general tab, you have the your language, et cetera, et cetera. You have the email configuration, which is uh, how you want the email to be composed, like the phones you're going to use, etc. Um, also, uh, so you have smart, uh, quick suggestions. You can read them. You can, you know, uh, suggest the replies. That's, for example, when you reply to a message, sometimes it just uh, prompts you to use uh, certain phrases and stuff like that. It's very useful. If you want to do it, just do it. Uh, these are the rules. Remember the rule that I created for Facebook is right here. Now, if I want to edit this rule, I just click here on the little pencil and I'm just going to rename it from Facebook. OK, uh, from Facebook to Facebook. OK, just going to rename it. Just click on save and that's it. That's the name of the folder. If I want to get rid of it, just click in, in this here uh, and then um, delete it. If I want to run, uh, let's say I have a 100 email from Facebook and I want to run uh, this rule and now I just click in this button here and it's going to run and it's going to move anything that you have in the inbox it's going to move it to Facebook uh, at the time okay so uh, this is basically um, what I wanted to show you 
um, which is very, uh, the look and feel is very straightforward. Um, you can have here also um, events. Uh, you can set up the email. This is the event, right? You, if you want to create a new email um, and that's it. The view you have here, uh, some other, uh, um, some other layout, some other uh, menus. Now, um, I want to, I want to show you quickly something. Um, I want to quickly show you something. So let's say here in the, in this, uh, in this um, email, let's say, for example, you just received this email and, and it's a phishing. And phishing is an email that's usually asking you to register, uh, to, uh, to, to get your uh, username and password or a bank email. I mean, a bank, an email pretending coming from the bank or a financial institution telling you to enter your email and password. Uh, which is totally, uh, it's totally uh, a phishing email. So you can always report it here. You can click here and report phishing or report junk. Um, also, you have some other um, menus here. You want to delete the email. Uh, remember to do that, you need to, to see this menu here, activate this menu here. You need to click on one uh, particular uh, email. You need to be sitting on one email here. And then uh, you can also action ignore, delete, uh, you can sweep uh, your sweep, meaning that uh, you can get rid of all the trash and things you don't need. Um, you can actually move the email, same manner uh, that we did uh, earlier. Uh, you can read, write, et cetera, et cetera. So I do like the the good uh, new look, the new look of, uh, of Outlook, because actually it just uh, compact and everything. It's in um, the menus are more uh, user-friendly and more uh, very well designed, in my opinion. Of course, you can have your own opinion, and um, um, and I hope you you like the video. And if you did, please give me a like and subscribe to my channel. And you can always suggest any other topic you want me to talk about, and I will gladly um, uh, create a video and upload it for you. Thank you, and have yourself a great day.